Hey guys, the Iceman here on the Iceman's Return YouTube channel in regards to TNA Wrestling. Um, you know, a lot of people are saying that MVP is not the guy that's going to, you know, make TNA rise to the top. You know, he's not expected to. He's just a guy there. Um, he was never really all that great in the WWE. But he's someone that, you know, we've never seen in TNA. And... Um, he could add some new, like, storylines to TNA. And, uh, you know, everybody's going to understand that 2014 is a new era for TNA. Um, it's not the TNA that it used to be. I don't think it ever will be. Um, there's been a lot of major changes in TNA. But um, I would say that, you know, give them a chance to see what they're going to do. Um also, I would I would say this, you know, I don't want to see TNA go down. I do not want to see them close. Um, I just, just do not want to see another wrestling company go down. And uh, so I continue to support TNA regardless of whether I agree with what they're doing or not. Um, there's been, you know, there's been a lot of things that I don't agree with. I think Dixie Carter needs to get off TV. Um, I don't like Rockstar Spud. Um, but, you know, we'll just have to wait and see what develops with TNA. Now, um, with, with that being said, um, <coughs> excuse me, with that being said, you know, a lot of people are, you know, are bashing TNA, but, you know, a lot of the people that are bashing TNA are WWE fans, and WWE is not a great spot at, at this moment either. I mean, I'm very bored with WWE. Um, the one thing about TNA I do like is because, you know, I only get to see it once a week, and I never really know what's going to happen because I try to avoid the spoilers. One of the things I don't like is the... The, the Bully Ray issue with the coffin, because it reminds me sort of like The Undertaker. But, um, and a lot of people are saying to me, well, you know, it's the same people wrestling the same guys all the time. And, uh, well, the roster's got like only 25 guys at this moment. I do believe they just signed Kenny King, so Kenny King will be back uh, for the X Division. Uh, he, was, he was a very good wrestler. Um, we'll, we'll have to wait and see what develops there. Uh, Jeff Hardy's supposed to be back from lockdown. Um, you know, we'll just have to wait and see. we got to give it like three or four months this year. And, you know, we can pretty much decide then, you know, where TNA is going. Um, but I really, I do not want to see TNA go down. I do not. I'm tired of seeing wrestling companies go down. Um. I just think it's it just brightens the eyes of Vince McMahon and the WWE. And, you know, the funny part about it is, you know, the WWE makes millions and millions of dollars. They get great ratings on their live Raw, but the show is not all that great. And, you know, if you're honest with yourself, you know it's true. So, with that being said... Let's give uh, TNA a chance. Let's give it to, like, you know, maybe April or May. And, you know, just really see what develops. So, all right, this is the Iceman here on the Iceman's Return YouTube channel. I'm sorry um, I've, you know, been, you know, a long time in between videos. But as you can tell, <coughs> I mean, you know, I've, I've been out. That's all I can tell you. And uh, I'm just going to try to... Um, do whatever I can when I can, and I hope everybody has a lot of patience and whatnot. But um, you know, I want to thank everybody for their their kind words that they've sent me. You know, hoping you know that I get well soon and everything. I really appreciate it. I'm trying to you know really get to to comment on a lot of things, but I, you know, it's been really tough to be honest with you. But uh, be patient, and uh, hopefully soon I'll be back in full force. 
and to my buddy Andre Corbell, keep doing those great videos. I mean, love your videos, buddy. I mean, I haven't really been able to, you know, say too much and comment too much, but when I get a chance, I do watch all your videos. So keep it going, buddy. Peace out, everybody.